Alright guys, so this is a new area where we land after we take out uh, the pig. I think he's called the yellow robe sage or whatever. Else, but uh, he uh, tells us about a story about the stands and uh, big mouse who was trying to take out some kind of a insect. That's where you belong. I'll meet your end here. You scorn my words? How have you served to the king's dinner? Uh, this is another tiger vanguard or something like that. Let's try to take him out. He does not really have a lot of big attacks. Looking easy so far. Got stuck in the box. This guy jumps a lot. A lot actually. He looks like a fake copy of the of the real tiger by the way. This is a bad attack. He definitely seems loaded. And there you go, he's dead. He's not dead, he's defeated. Now he's got a pin in the back. Such fierce staff work. You wield grand might. <laughs> Brave soul, why not use this might to aid my king's good deed? <sighs> Our king comes from Mount Lingshan. His kind heart seeks to end the place's suffering. The Yaowai's skills run deep. And with your help, our chances will be doubled. Alright, let's uh... The king is just ahead. With my meager skills, I cannot join you. Please, go aid him quickly. Truth be known, being a father of two little ones, my life is not mine to give. Worry not, the Yellowwing King is a noble disciple from Mount Lingshan. Go and meet him. A good camera awaits you there. Yeah, suppose we just have to go forward. We can't really do anything here. Yeah, there's a waypoint coming in as well. Kingdom of... Not exactly sure what. Sindri or what? <clears throat> Yeah, the first thing you need to do is get into a shrine so that there's a saving point. So no matter what happens, you can just restart. So after taking a rest, let's just go back to the... Before going to let me just check it out. Alright, there was nothing there. Apart from sand, so I just came back. Honestly, there's a lot of running that you have to do in the game. You bested my vanguard! <laughs> then you do indeed have skills. That Yao Guai must have some vessel that counters me. 
Even my Samadhi wind can't hurt it. <sighs> there is only one way to draw out this Yaogwai. I'll sound the drums and it'll come forth. If you are willing, I ask you to seize its vessel at the right time. Then the Yaogwai will be mine. Looks like something big that has come now. Western end of the world. Each day, the sun sets and boils the sea. The boiling hiss is sharp enough to ravage babies in their cradles. The people sound drums to counter the impact, but the drums draw this Yaogwai. The vessel this Yaogwai holds protects it from me. Your boldness in venturing here is clear. Aid me with this. It's right here, beneath us in the sands. Together, we shall rid the people of this wretched Yaogwai. It's right here, beneath us in the sands. Uh, that was a touching story, so let's just go down and uh, try to take out that insect. Yaogwai. Oh, you take a... Uh, I didn't know that you take a hit once you jump out too far from way up there. It looks so peaceful standing there. Alright, so basically the idea is that uh, you have to take out those claws, otherwise you don't really take out any damage, so I'm just trying to hit his claws as much as possible, and the target changes from the left to right and right to left, back and forth. Honestly the fight is easy, you just have to keep on dodging him as soon as he makes the attacks. But this is a very prolonged fight as compared to the normal fights that take 1 to 3 minutes normally. Some of the fights are a little bit longer, just like this one. You just have to be a little bit careful from the attacks. Just about took me out. And the second time.
I see I'm not looking that great at the moment, but uh, we're still doing okay. So far, we're not dead. Again, that, that was a waste of effort because I could not really get the claw. going down somewhere I like the music in the background almost gives me like a Final Fantasy type of feeling You have to dodge him just at the last moment. As long as the drum beats, that one will not get away. There's uh, some kind of a cutscene going on. Okay, so he's uh, temporarily. Now, the vessel. Okay, I have to seize the vessel. I can't really take him out. This was the perfect opportunity, by the way. How do you climb up, though? Now he decides to help us out. This fight is going to be easy now because both of us are attacking him at the same time. Go just a little bit. Remaining. Don't Strike. Yeah, just about dead now. There we go. Defeated the Jaguar King Fuban. Get a trophy as well. That is a nice cut, nice cut to me right there. Yeah, 
and he's dead. So that was a nice fight, and uh, the person helping us out right now, that's actually the final boss of uh, this chapter as well. So it's just strange the way the story has uh, brought us to this junction, but... On the folks' behalf, I thank you. But my understanding is that maybe you went into the past and uh, maybe it's the original monkey who went up there and got that um, wine, uh, wind tamer vessel from there. But I don't know, this is a confusing part of the story, I could not really get it. But uh, we got the wind tamer which is very important for the final boss fight.